three key challenges before hr currently currently or three challenges to hr or in the current situation you are saying yeah three key <laughs> challenges the hr is facing not uh, uh, to hr but what are the three challenges before hr okay number one is uh, uh, well everyone knows that we are digitally leapfrogging all right we are getting into a total leapfrog right. we would have reached that state 30 years later but the pandemic leapfrogged it and brought us into the digital technology 30 years into the new technology now having done that the challenge before hr in this situation is what is the model of the business that will have to be adopted as a leader because i don't see the hr role only limited to the people of the organization hr is a leadership role all right it is something that has to influence leaders right. therefore the challenge before hr at this point of time is what is the right leadership model that needs to be adopted in the given leapfrogging of digital technology and secondly in that situation what is the kind of manpower we will require in terms of number size shape characteristics capabilities and competencies so that is one of the greatest challenge do we continue with what manpower we had in the same shape that it was or do we acknowledge the cognizance of this digital leapfrog and what are the changes that we need to be making that is the first one currently the understanding of digital capability is limited to zoom google and uh, team meetings all right so people who can do zoom people who can do uh, google meets they believe they have arrived on the right. threshold of technological advancement versus the reality is that this is only a connecting technology of a very very short period of time it came into real prominence because of the pandemic situation right. so how do we induce the digital capabilities in our people beyond uh, uh, and and what kind of footprints do we require to be able to manage the human resources of an organization not hr departments of the organization the talent resources in the organization without making them feel that they are digital resources how do we tap their dig uh, digital potentials to be able to uh, comp uh, contribute to the organization and with the changing economy comes in this you know we believed before the coming of the pandemic that we are going to have the millennials coming in right. and everyone kept on asking now millennials will come in now there is gig economy the pandemic period has made organizations realize that it is not the age of the millennials but now it's the age of the perennials which means whoever irrespective of their age color mm. shape size qualification whoever can deliver whoever can deliver to what the organizational need and challenges the world is going to belong to him because no longer is he expected to travel no longer is the level of things that we believed that the youngs could do and the older ones could not do those kinds of limitations have gone women are now participating because they don't need to be physically going to office so they can continue to manage their domestic systems along with participating in the work uh, of an organization from their home environment right. all right so all of these challenges which are coming and which have been reshaped the entire insight has been reshaped therefore how do we use this entire reshaping of insights to be able to deliver to the organizations of the changed world what the talent and people requirement would be those are the three challenges which most hr leadership should be focusing and uh, putting their energy on